Hello, it's great to be with you, and no problems at all on the weather front as we get ready for this match. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and my partner, ready to bring you all the analysis and technical talk, is Stuart Robson. And what we have on the menu for you is live coverage of this hero Indian Super League match. It's Jamshed Poor, and they take on FC Goa. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Well, here is the lineup for the hosts today. Well, it'll be interesting to see how the wingers play today. Will they stay high and wide? Will they come in field and support the centre forward? And how deep will they come out of possession? They're going to be key to this formation. And introducing the visitors' lineup today. Well, it's a great system when played well, but it's very reliant on wide players who have the pace to run behind the opposition and fullbacks that are good going forward. Well, they certainly have both of those. And the contest begins. Greg Stewart. The referee correctly just... He's in with a chance. Well, he stormed through, but it didn't end well for him. Well, in those situations, you have to make a few decisions. Unfortunately, he's made the wrong one. Martinez and a tidy challenge And that's going to roll all the way through. Greg Stewart. It might be the moment to get them ahead. Oh, that is a majestic goal! Volleyed home with precision and style. Superbly done. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And what a great finish it is. Struck with power and accuracy, certainly no stopping that. Now back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Martinez now there to intercept now that would be straightforward for any keeper and the referee blows for a foul The throw in forthcoming. And the quality of pass needs to be a bit better. Really good attacking play. 
Well, he tried to put everything into the shot, but couldn't find the target. Ben Tozer, Peter Hartley. Can he find the net? Able to get a body in the way. Well, a corner kick it is. Let's see if they can put this to good use as they try to add to their advantage. Over it comes. Still possibilities. Well, another corner following on from the last one. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. Melero the attack continues they're making considerable progress well, just the tackle that was needed you can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it booking it to come you would think well, the referee not messing about he's cautioned him well it had to be a yellow card and he knew it was coming Sing. Greg Stewart. A chance for him to get in behind, maybe. And the danger still on. Superbly read and executed. Counter attacking, very much an option. Will it be sufficiently imaginative? Crossing possibilities. Timely intervention. How can they be creative from here? Time coming up shortly, and the home side on top. Stuart, interested to get your critique. Well, I think they've been the better side in this first half. They've defended well, they've looked dangerous in attack, and they've controlled the midfield. It's been a solid performance so far. That's a well struck pass. How can he take them on and beat them? And they'll get ready for the throw in. Options in the centre. Oh, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. Melero. And snuffing out the danger. So two minutes of stoppage time here. He just needs to remain icy cool. And a goal! There he is at the double. They just can't subdue him. Well, here we can see it again, and it starts with the ball over the top, perfectly weighted, and from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. Two nil here, and the ball is moving again. The first half here comes to an end. Well, we're picking him out for a reason. He's having a tremendous...
well underway once more and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half What's the keeper doing? Martins. Well, you've got to classify that as a poor attempt. A long way wide. into the advanced position must score and it's come off the keeper well he stumped it out of there without much fuss well what a magnificent save that was it really was top class goalkeeping and the referee felt he had to blow the whistle Take it away. It's a good looking ball in behind. Well, when all was said and done, he's failed to hit the target. minutes to go then well they keep the ball moving well they couldn't keep that sequence going unfortunately this might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity goalkeeper's ball every day of the week Reboyedo. Oh, stylish ball. What can they do now? Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. Could be. In it goes to alter the arithmetic and give them hope that they can turn this round. Well, let's look at this again. The one and two touch passing is absolutely outstanding to play around the pressure. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish. which gives the keeper no chance. So there we have it, 2-1. Taking it away. 20 minutes remaining now. Oh, lovely ball. Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. And time for the change now. And never in any doubt from the keeper. Oh, he looks threatening. Has a go. And using his body to good effect. Being pressed and pressed high. And attempting the through ball. 
No hiding from the fact that they really should have extended their lead. Well, that was a poor miss. Could they come to regret that? Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Melero. Well, on the attack, hunting for a late equaliser here. Brilliant save. And there it is. A goal. I must say, much to the annoyance of the keeper. Well, here we can see it again. Normally, I'm the first to point the finger at a goalkeeper, but I think it's a good initial save. I'm not sure he could have done much more. Just a bit unfortunate, really, that it dropped to an opponent. Back underway, dead level, 2-2. Still pushing for what could be a winner. Teammates to play it to. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Now can they counter clinically? And they'll regard that as a very disappointing end to the move. Now what can they do from here? Still not clear. Oh, a vital interception. He's in with a chance. Late drama, and now they're in front. Well, here it is. Head down, hit through the ball, and get it on target. That's a top-class finish. There was no stopping that. is moving again 3-2 and that puts them in position and that is the end of the contest and not a happy outcome as far as the visitors are concerned yes Derek they were well off their usual standards today and with the quality that they have in their squad I think it's fair for the fans to demand more too many bystanders for me just not good enough his performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Stuart. Well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic, and he scored a couple of goals. What a player he is.